This is Andy Perawal for Boxing News. I'm joined by Derek Chisora here in Birmingham. Derek, straight to, we've just seen the flashy, the showboaty, the future star of British boxing, Ben Whitaker return. What did you make of his performance in the ring? Delicious. <clears throat> you know, I, I was sitting there and I go, but for fuck's sake, finish him now. <laughs> and he knocked him down. That's when he finished him. But it was good. Listen, he's a good kid, man. He's going he's gonna to do amazing. He's going to be a Marmite character. You're either going to love him, you're going to hate him. But for anybody who isn't on his side, what would you say to him? I don't think so. I think, I think his character is for, for the younger fans. And the younger fans need to, need to gel the younger fans. And how you gel younger fans, he has to be on Twitter and on Instagram and, on, and stuff like that. And, uh, and TikTok, by doing all that stuff. And they gel with him like that. So it's going to be amazing. People can see him step up now. What, what would you say should be next for him? Who's in his division? The top names, obviously, the likes of Abouatsi. He's called for a Dan Aziz fight. He's a British and European champion. Why um, not? Why not? Why not? Would you think that Ben would be ready for that? <laughs> if he's calling it out, why not? Derek, just want to move forward. Saudi, this doubleheader, Bonanza show, Fury Usyk, Joshua Wilder. Will we see it? You're the man out there. You're, you're now the promoter for Saudi, so will we see it? Delicious. You know what? When my boss came up with that idea, I said to him, hey man, what are we doing after? <laughs> yeah, I said, what are we gonna do after? Do you understand? What my boss is trying to do, what he's doing is, it's like, it's like a man having a, a, a foursome, yeah? With Johnny Lopez, yeah? Yeah, Britney Spears, the, the back in the day Britney Spears, yeah. All the hottest fucking Hollywood chicks. What comes after that? And Rihanna's in there as well, sitting on, her, sitting on your face. That's exactly what my boss is doing for the, for the fans. And it's unbelievable. So we definitely see that then? Oh, mate, of course I want to do I want to be in that fucking five song. I'm joking. <laughs> There's a lot of talk, Derek, about how much money would be needed to make that type of show, though. Talk to what? me. And guess what? The Saudis have it. The Kingdom of Saudi Arabia have it and they will deliver what they want. In the meantime, Derek, there's been talks of Fury Zhang. Zhila Zhang seems to be the front runner to face Tyson. Just your, your thoughts on that? I think he should fight George Royce. Even though, even though Zhang beat him? Yeah, why not? <clears throat> entertainment is a game. The game is called entertainment. We can give George Royce a, uh, a guy with two legs to fight and he'll beat him and then he fights Tyson Fury. It's entertainment. I'll buy that fight. George Joyce had a bad night that day. I think George Joyce and Tyson Fury would be a better fight. Derek, I know you're very close with Anthony Joshua. An article came out this week from Thomas Thomas Hauser suggesting he should retire. Did, uh, Thomas Hauser suggesting Anthony Joshua who's, should retire. Thomas, Thomas Hauser is a very respected um, writer within the industry, been around for many years. Many years? Yeah. How come he's not fucking retired? <laughs> he's been around in this industry for so many years. How come he's not fucking retired? It's a dick. Um, obviously, in the meantime, there's a lot of talk about what next for AJ away from the summer boat at the end of the year. Do you think we see him end of summer? You can see him tomorrow if you want to. I'll give you his house address. <laughs> I'd love that. I'd love to turn up. <laughs> Go check him. He lives in Hampstead, in Bristol's Avenue. Go check him out. <laughs> on, a, on a fighting front, do we see him return to the ring in the summer? Listen, AJ retires today. Dylan didn't retire today, myself retired today. What the fuck you got to talk about? Nothing. See? Exactly. So until we see somebody who's better suited to come entertain you miserable bastards, then we might hang up the glass. But before that, nobody can entertain you like how we entertain you. So shut the fuck up and enjoy us, bro. Derek, I'm certainly enjoying you tonight. You've been on great form. Just the final one on yourself. Any update? Will you be returning to the ring anytime soon? Yeah, Eddie announced the deal. Eddie's going to announce the date. Yeah. You got an opponent confirmed? For yourself? Yeah, Eddie's going to announce it. Top man, Derek. Last word from you. Anything you'd like to leave on? Yeah. Suck a dick, bitch. No, I'm joking. <laughs> Go save the king. <laughs>